What's going on guys? It is Michael and welcome back to my room. Quick video planned out today and today's date is March 27th and spring break was just last week for me. It could be for you this week and summer is just around the corner. So what does that mean? It means that everyone wants to look really fat and overweight on the beach, right? No, not really. Quite the opposite. People want to look cut, slim, firm, toned, whatever adjective you like to use, that's great. So in order to do this, people start doing a lot more cardio at around this time of the year. So I figured I would make a quick video and go over when is the best time to do cardio. And are you ready for the answer? To be honest, there is no best time. And I think the best time is whatever fits into your schedule. You could do cardio in the morning when you first wake up or you could do it late at night. It doesn't matter when you do it as long as you're doing it because you're gonna burn calories either way. And really quick, people always ask, should I do cardio before or after weights? Let's get that out of the way really quick. You should always, or in my opinion, do cardio after your weightlifting session because if you're dieting for a long period of time, you want to maintain as much of your hard-earned muscle as possible. So always put weights first. That should be your main priority. And then afterwards, you could do a cardio session of 30 minutes or whatever your preferred time length is. But that's just my opinion. Now, I'm not saying you can't do like a five-minute warm-up before a leg workout because that's pretty smart to do just to get ready for the heavy weights. But I would always do cardio after my weights. And of course, in an ideal world, you could split up your cardio session and your weightlifting session, and that would be great, but let's face it, people have lives, jobs, kids, whatever else you have to do, students, and it doesn't really always work like that. So that's just what I like to do, put the cardio after weights and just stay for 30 more minutes or so and just get it out of the way. So to sum this up, does it matter when you do cardio or what is the best time? And the best time is whatever fits into your schedule and the only thing that really matters is that you're doing it because you're going to burn calories either way like I said and it's going to put you in a deficit. But that's pretty much all I've got for this video. just wanted to make it because I figured it would be a pretty popular topic right now. And I've been really busy this week, so that's why there hasn't been that many videos. And if you don't, like, follow me or anything, you can just get out of the video. I won't really care. But tomorrow morning, I have to get up at 4 a.m. And I'm going on a live news interview. And I am just, like, wow. I mean, if you watch my old videos, you know I was pretty bad on camera. And I'm still not the best because I'm sitting here talking to a metal pole. I'm trying my best, though. And I'm just a little bit nervous. So if you want me to make a vlog of that experience, maybe I will. Let me know down below in the comments. And as always, if you enjoyed it, I wouldn't get mad at you if you gave the video a like. A little thumbs up to the like button, maybe. And Facebook and Twitter are in the description, as well as Instagram. Hope you guys are having a great week, and I will talk to you later. Later.